All right, I'm back. Uh, got uh, Jim Dolan, an artist, uh, a sculptor from uh, Bozeman, uh, coming over uh, to visit with me yeah, about a possible commission or something like that. But uh, so again, I don't know how long I'll be sculpting. Trying to decide whether to put a. Well, I think I will. Come on in! This the guy? Yep, this is the guy. Hold on a second. Alright, I got a commission to do uh, a sculpture. And uh, it's going to be going on a plaque, a historical plaque. And it's going to be, I guess, on a, a big ranch here in Montana. Uh, I think it's one of the biggest ranches, if not the biggest ranch in Montana. Anyway, these two gentlemen, this guy here and this guy here, uh, are the guys I'm going to be doing. The only trouble is, this is the only photographs I've got of them. And it's very hard to work from photographs like these that have no definition of face and stuff like that. So, what I'm going to do, one guy wore a hat all the time, and this guy never wore a hat. And I'm going to dress him in 19... 20s uh, style clothing and uh, they they had everything taken away from them I think that's what uh, Jim was telling me and they were left with four dollars and fifty eight cents and uh, from that they built an empire a cattle empire uh, of short horn uh, bulls and cattle and stuff like that um, back in the early part of the last century so um, I'm thinking I'm going to just do mainly a, a side view of them looking at the, the money that they got left uh, in the palm of one of their hands and uh, I don't think they'd be smiling about it so I, I don't think I can do the smiles. Anyways, there aren't much many photographs of them and uh, this is the idea of a plaque where the circle was here. And the plaque is built up and then the wording around it. I think it's going to go on a building. I'm not sure of that though. But anyway, got a uh, lid from a uh, container. It'll make a perfect uh, border for the clay. And I'll do the clay directly onto here. And uh, we'll see how it works. Right now I'm getting a board. A scrap piece of board ready to be used uh, for this and uh, I think the only thing I'm going to be able to do is get started on this and give this a little thickness so I can so they can cast it and uh, what do I do with my doohickey there it is so this is about a quarter inch thick that's enough thickness to uh, make it castable and now just put this on there and uh, I'll fill in around the edges. First I need to take care of the edge that points out here. So let's see what we got. Let's mark it. Okay, all corners are covered. Back in the hole here and attach it. Make sure the edges aren't pointing out. Feels good. 
good. I'm going to put four screws in it now. I've got a slight gap in the uh, board, so what I'm going to do is fill that in with clay. I have got one problem. I've got uh, this thing trying to come up on the edges, so I'm just going to put some short screws into this. Let's see, I've got a little one inches right here. Even all the way around. All right, let's try putting some clay on it. You gotta be careful that I don't push in on the sides of the hole. I mean, this uh, lid. So I need to. Uh, too hard. That's what I'm trying to say. Okay, let me just put a thin layer of clay in here. I'm just adding my clay colored paint and for those of you who are new to my channel and uh, Facebook page the uh, paint was uh, made years ago I took a piece of clay to the paint department of a local hardware store which at that time was a uh, black, old blacksmith shop from uh, the 1800s and since disappeared for a modern one, which is sad. Anyway, I had the, the color of the clay matched with paint, or they mixed paint to match my clay. Anyway, uh, it looks just like my clay. Makes it less confusing to the eye. Also allows me to see imperfections and where I need to uh, do some work and uh, so that's why I paint. It doesn't affect the uh, sculpture at all and it certainly doesn't affect the uh, bronze. It's just uh, an aid for me so that I can see what I need to do. Well, that's going to do it for today because I'm not going to try to do anything on the figures until I work out some kind of design. And I may just work it out on the, on this tomorrow. But uh, that will be it for today. I know it wasn't much, but uh, everything has to start with something. Good night, everybody. Hope you got something out of this video.